I'm oh, sorry, we can talk more about. I don't want to interrupt. Oh no, you're good. You're good. I gotta, I gotta keep it moving. Anyway. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, man, but watch out for that. You know that's in the scriptures. I saw it on the news. Like, I work for an atheist. They, they pushing it more and more every day. I see. I see. But that's definitely no. You, the oh, no. You, say, you, you take the mark of the beast, you're gonna be destroyed. Don't believe. So whatever you do, do not take that chip. No. We supposed to be warning you know? people okay, about so that too. An atheist teach you then so let me they, ask you a question. They don't believe in nothing then. Well, Y'all have a good one. Where's right, your man? Thank you. Thank you for stopping. Where's your man when it comes to mind that the man, he wrote this shit himself? What man? King James. King James. King James. King James is an Israelite. Okay. So what? The winners always win. Right? Right? The winners always win, yeah. Okay, he's the one who wrote the fucking book. But King James was just authorized the English translation. Because actually, the New Testament was originally in Greek, and the Old Testament was in Hebrew. So we still got the old manuscripts going back two, three thousand years. You know okay. what I'm saying? Yeah. Psalm 14 that one. Good, though. Yeah. Psalm 14 one. The fool but, has said in his heart, there is no God. That's an atheist for you. Oh, the scripture called him the fool. This, this boy who said he followed. He said he followed, okay. right? So the Bible no, refers no, to no, people no, like no, that no. as fools. I didn't say I, I, I didn't say I followed him. Okay, what you doing with the fool? I said, I hear. You hear him? What's he talking? What's he saying? The, the, the Bible is man-made. He said right? that's what that's what he's saying. It is. Tell me one thing on this earth that's not man-made. <laughs> Shit. You, me, whatever. Okay. The earth. Wait, wait, actually, we are. Well, we're not. Yeah, oh, right. Right. Man, actual yeah. man laid down yeah. with our mom and popped the shit out of it and made us. So everything yeah. is man-made. Right? Exactly. Know? So everything is. So, so for what I'm saying is. Because this book was written by men. No, you can't King James. It. Is that a King James version? It's a King James version. Okay, King James Version. Guess what? The winners always win, and the losers always lose. No, that's not true. But that's what I'm that's at, a goddamn let me say, truth. Let me say real quick, because, you know, the under, we the underdogs, so eventually we're going to win. Cause we've been losing for a whole life, but we're going to win eventually. We, I'm, what I meant to say before was that one thing that's not man-made, what thing that you believe, history, science, math, all that shit, what's one thing? I don't know. Okay, hey, what one thing is, is, is not man-made, it's not written by man that you believe today? Everything's written by everything, man. Everything, everything, the only thing people say is that okay, right, the Bible is man-made, but they don't say that about history. Why do they don't say about that for? They don't say that about the... Listen, uh, years and years and years yeah. before you right. was scrolled. You get your point. Right, right. Right? Right. Yeah. Now then scrolls tell you about it. Right, just the Bible was scrolls at one time. Yeah. But they don't tell everything <laughs> in that Bible. They don't tell everything in that Bible. Maybe the scriptures tell so much it will make your head explode. Here you go. Check this out. This is 1 Corinthians 2 and 7. But we speak the wisdom of the Most High in a mystery. Even the hidden wisdom which the Most High ordained before the world. That's, that, our that we, that's why we got the mystery. We got all these deep secret mysteries, you know, the average person don't know. And who are you affiliated with? With the Yahweh Baha Shem Yahweh Shai? The who? Yahweh Baha Shem Yahweh Shai. I just gonna keep them to me. Oh, yeah. Man, I've never so even heard is, that. Come book my book, you know, having an interpreter. Yeah. You know, yeah. Interpret. Now that's the name of the Lord <laughs> in Hebrew. The Lord, the Lord is a Hebrew, right? So he got a Hebrew name. <laughs> We're in Hebrew. We Hebrew Israelites, so we're supposed to speak the Hebrew tongue. That's why I told you the Old Testament is in Hebrew. A real Old Testament. Really, the King James Bible is not even a really. A, it's not. It's an English Bible. What do you hold? But that's the English though. Well, we but gotta the, read English so you can yeah. understand it. But a real Bible was Hebrew, because we is Hebrew Israelites. So. You gotta I mean, know that. This ain't Paraz. The Paraz come out here and just keep speaking Hebrew. Oh, yeah. And what would be interpret nothing. You won't know, interpret nothing. You I, ain't gonna learn nothing. I'm not knocking none of you guys' shit here. I, I, I swear to God, I'm not. Because I'm kind of seeking. Seeking? Right, right. Seeking, seeking, you shall find. Seeking, you shall find. Yeah. Right, but. Yeah, right see. Now, I'm, you I'm, just a little tipsy, man. You can't calm down. 
You know, that's all. I need to get that's tipsy. I just need get to be sober a, shot. a little bit, man. Sober up a little bit. No, you don't. You ain't bringing out nothing for nobody else. Right, you gotta come nope. out here and share it, man. Yeah, yeah, we we gotta fuck though. What's wrong with being a brother? Yeah, yeah, right. Right. What, you want something? Hell yeah, 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 I want something. Let's go to the motherfucking. Well, when we done, we can get some damn. After we done, we can. After we done. Yeah. When we go out here, man. Shut the fuck up. What are you talking about? Listen, listen. What do you do, man? Listen, listen. We gotta do the father's work first. We what do you do got that I ain't first. got? I got a little bit of dollars, and I can cover this motherfucking thing right here. <laughs> listen, okay, I'm getting back in First Corinthians, second two. Hey, yeah. Listen, listen. Let your brother speak to you. Listen, not which none That's of the princes of this world knew. Let me go back again, verse seven. But we speak the wisdom of the Most High in a mystery, even the hidden wisdom which the Most High ordained for the world unto our glory, which none of the princes of this world knew. For all had no, they known it, they would not have crucified the Lord of glory. But as it is written, I have not seen, nor ear heard, neither have entered into the heart of man the things which the Most High have prepared for them that love him. But the Most High have revealed them unto us. I'm going back to the King yeah, James. It's a mystery. That's what I'm going yeah. back to. It revealed yeah. unto us the mystery, the truth. Right. And the, the truth, and one of the mysteries, people don't even know they're Israelites. That's a they don't. Mystery. They don't know the real name, and they don't know that the Lord's name is not Jesus. Okay, I'm gonna ask you one more question. Remember the script I read to you? What Matthew? are you guys actually? We're Israelites. We're Israelites. We're Israelites. That's our true, not white, not black. That, those are just made up names, man. That's not a true nationality being called white and black. Our true nationality are Hebrew Israelites, but whatever tribe we're from, that's what we are. Hebrew Israelites. See, I don't even see one. See it on there. That's why you think I read Matthew 15. The law, he's only sent unto the lost sheep. Lost means lo you're lost. So you, you don't know who you like are. like the 144? Well, yeah. at one time, yeah. the 144 didn't know they were lost. They yeah. actually, the 144 so, were lost sheep. Yeah, yeah. So that time. means I'm not even on there. You are on there. What? Pentecostal? No. That's, that's not a people. You probably, well, you, I ain't chances it. are you look like you Irish, Scots, or something. But it all didn't go back to the Israelites. That's right. Oh. Pentecostal, whatever you're saying, is not the nationality. That's a religion. That's a religion. Look, my guy right here, he, he don't even know what he's talking about. He's he like, he, yeah, he I'm know, done. He know all the I'm truth. done with this shit. <laughs> he know all the truth. Hey, look for real, man. Hey, look. Look at me. Are you a person? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm a person just as you are. We yeah, Israelites, though. You show me what's right. Huh? You show me what's right. The, this sign right here, we should to tell you. What do you mean, that sign? Hold on, I got a guy for you. Oh, fuck a goddamn sign. That's part of prophecy. That's part of prophecy. That's part of prophecy. That's part of prophecy. You got to do it. The sign. No, you ever heard the saying, pictures, a picture speaks a thousand words? Yeah. You just look at some picture, man, and they be so graphic. That's the reason why I asked. They, they tell the whole story. Because you, you're the one that, that sent it first. Right, what? Say that again. But he's about to set the second. Uh, okay, uh, this is uh, Daniel's 9 and 7. It says, Oh Lord, righteousness belongs unto thee, but unto us confusion of faces. That's why you don't really specifically really see yourself on here as you think, because oh. you're, you're so called white, but you scattered among so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. What do you mean, white? It says so called white. That's why I say you confusion oh. of faces. It's confusion of faces. Israel scattered among all nations. It's a confusion of faces. So. Somebody might be a different skin color than you or something, but you could actually both be Israelites. Just because you look different than somebody don't mean that you're not the same people. So that's that bullshit they try to teach us in this world. In this world, they separate you by skin color and not by nationality. Because you are who your father's was. No matter where your father's sperm came from, if your father going back 2,000 generations was an Israelite, you're an Israelite. See what I'm saying? Does that make sense? Gotcha. It makes well, perfect sense. Where, wherever you come from, from your father's line, that's who you are. Not the mother. The, the mother doesn't matter. It's all about who your father's 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 father was. If your father's father, 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 father was an Israelite, you're an Israelite. That's what we're going into. That's who we are. Okay, so who are you? You got that? Yeah, I got it. Not. You're Israelite. I'm an Israelite. That's you why are? I'm, yeah, that's why we're out here teaching. To wake You're up. You're an Israelite. Is there, is there? 
And I'm an Israelite. Did you guys show me any fucking proof, man? No, well, Look, all we need is the scriptures. If you understand the spirit, then you'll know then. It ain't about the scripture. The spirit. What about the spirit? Show me. You, I, you can't see the spirit with your eyes. You gotta look 22 at 22 and 2. 22 and 2. Yeah, all that crazy shit that they I got you. advertise upon. I don't know about that. All I know is the spirit. You don't know, you can't feel the spirit? The Holy Spirit? I know the Holy Spirit. Well, you. Well, oh, you, yeah, I got one. We know who we, we, you guys we, are always, you know, you guys are out here representing whatever you guys feel. Yeah, it's what he's commanded to. Listen, everything you guys believe is belief. Now it's all according to the Bible. Go ahead. This is John 7 and 17. It says, if any man would do his will, oh, I'm sorry, 16. It says, Yahweh Shah, which is the most high, well, not the most high, uh, the Lord's name, Jesus. It says, Yahweh Shah answered them and said, my doctrine is not mine. The, yeah, my doctrine is not mine, so what we teach is not our own knowledge, you know what I'm saying? It's the most high. It ain't nothing we make up. Right? man made. It says, but his that sent me, which is Yahweh, which is the most high name, all right? If any man will do his will, he shall know of the doctrine, whether it be of God or whether it's I speak of myself. All right, so, I mean, it's up to you. If you don't want to believe that what we're saying is of the most high, you, you ain't got to believe us. Well, well we're going to try mean? our best to try and show you, though, prove it yeah. the scriptures that we are, though, you know? Because we know the spirit itself bears witness that's that we got what, the truth. That's, that's what I got. Oh, this. go ahead. That's why I got this. It's Deuteronomy 14 and 2. It says, For thou art an holy people unto the Lord thy power, and the Lord hath chosen thee to be a peculiar people right. unto himself. Yeah. Now, who's, so the like most, who's the most fascinating people on this planet Earth? This it's the Israelites. We're the best athletes. And that's the main thing that proves, proves who we are. The, or us being the athletes, the only athletes that are rocking the world, right? Yep. The music industry. All the motherfuckers in the music industry, from whether it's R&B, the rock and roll, the whatever the hell, black Jews, all that's all, those are all Israelites, man. But they don't know they're Israelites. So you're talking about the best guitar you know players, best dancers, best singers. They don't know they're Israelites. Have they, have they concluded that, that that's what they are? No, they don't know. The but they're, they're, they're they hearing they know. are. They're, a lot of them are hearing they are, though. Whether they hold, hold on to it is on them, though. You know, but a lot of it's, it, this truth is coming out. Everybody's hearing who the real lost sheep of the tribe, the real lost tribe of Israel really is. The whole world is starting to hear that now. Just like you out here now, you're starting to. You, the Lord got you out here for a reason, so you would know. You know, but let me finish this. Shit. Now, this I got to probably miss ten bucks. I don't That's give right. a guilt That's, That's a right. good spirit. You really need a ride, I can go up Okay, for thou and the Lord have chosen me to be a peculiar people unto himself above all the nations that are upon the earth. Okay? But that's what we're coming back to. That's what's going on in the world. We're, we're heading to that. We're going to be above all nations on the earth. All the mother rat nations going to be our slaves, man. Yep. You know, they're going to be serving you. They're going to be serving your children. Your children. So what's your, what is your actual Pentecostal belief? No, no, that's what I'm telling you. Our, our belief is, through faith, we believe we are the real children of Israel. We are Hebrew Israelites. Through faith, we believe that. You know, and actually through the Spirit, it's proven that. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That That's what's beautiful about it, the Spirit, how the Spirit is, man. But we can sit out here all day and talk about the Spirit. Your, it's going to leave people Your Bible out. Yeah. Talk to me now. It's my sword. I, I got a precept. What did you about to do? I was gonna get, well, you already read one of them, I'm gonna read another one. Deuteronomy 7 and 6. For thou art an holy people unto the Lord thy God. The Lord thy God hath chosen thee to be a special people unto himself above all people that are upon the face of the earth. So the Lord said we above all the other nations on the earth. We're supposed to be a special people unto himself. Let me ask you a question. Go ahead. I'm Protestant. I believe in Christianity. Now, what can you guys tell me about Christianity that really makes me believe? Let's go back to Antioch. Well, well, they celebrate Christmas. Christmas is a, uh, that's paganism. Any historian will tell you that. That's when, they, when the pagans became Christians, they kept all their old pagan holidays and mixed it in with Christianity. Well, we're in the Bible that say that Jesus said to put a Christmas tree up in your house. That's part of the pagan traditions. 
That's all. You know, ain't none of that in the scriptures. December 25th ain't in the Bible. Easter. Yeah, but that's the one. That's a big deal. Okay. Yeah, that's paganism. The... Man. Think about it, though. We're going to do what that's the Lord like... said. The Bible is different than Christianity. Christianity is tra tradition of men. You know, that's all tradition. That's shit they made up. It is not what the Bible actually says. The Bible actually says the, the truth. What the Christians are teaching is bullshit, pretty much. Pretty much. <laughs> just, just be straight with it. It's bullshit. Because they, they celebrate Christmas. They celebrate Halloween. Devil worshiping. Okay? Yeah, everything they teach no, is wrong. No, no, it's Isaiah 38 and 4. Isaiah 38 and 4 said, Remember now, O Lord, I beseech thee, how I have walked before thee in truth and with perfect heart. So that's what he's saying to you. He, he, we're giving you the truth, man. You know, and we can't come out here. You can't do it. Man, you got to learn the truth, period. That's just simply yeah. what we're the truth. You know, you ever heard of saying that the truth hurts? You know, a lot of people don't want to hear the truth because it hurts them. Because they've been, for years, they've been doing wrong. Man, we corrected ourselves. We humbled ourselves. Because all that shit we learned before, we, it was wrong. But we humbled ourselves and learned the truth. Okay? You got to learn to cast off all that filth of the world that the world taught you. And just cling to the truth, man. Okay. And other things that they still teaching that Jesus is a white man. Because that's not in the scriptures. The scriptures clearly say he was a black man. That's all through the Bible. No, it doesn't say that he was a black man. Yeah, it does. No, it doesn't. It is. He said, he said that he was a man. Wool. He says he had wool hair. He had hair of wool. You don't get the scriptures. The Lord's a black man. Fucked up spot right now. The scripture. No, you in a fucked up spot right now. We got all the scriptures. Look, look, look. If you, if you, if you was, uh, if you was looking for somebody for an investigation, and they tell you look for somebody that have woolly hair, and it's between me and this, this nigga right here, between me. <laughs> who, 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 right there. Oh, that's a good question. Who's the one that got woolly hair? Oh, you they fucked up for that. They cover for you. Uh, you me. fucked up for that. Who, they, they does, who got the woolly hair? <laughs> hey, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you fucked up for that. Just that because you got that. woolly hair. Listen, listen, this is, is revelation. You want to believe that? Listen, 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 listen. Get the